What's up YouTube, Inzuru here, and I have two more boxes of uh, Team Dragon's Vanity Extra Booster. Um, these might be the last two boxes I get for a while, primarily because one, uh, Astral Force has come out soon, which is Gear Chronicle, Genesis, and Angel Feather, and uh, I really want to get the Gear Chronicle related stuff, and uh, and I'm almost done with my con my com collection with the the set, so uh, yeah. <laughs> To, to recap, I guess, I finished my playset of Revens, and got a third Claret Sword, and for uh, Grade 1 Searchers, I only got a Mighty Dragon, or my, I only got the third Mighty Bolt Dragoon, which is really great, because I already have playsets of the other Grade 1 Searchers, so, uh, hopefully I can get one more Mighty Bolt Dragoon out of this, out of these two boxes. And for the Vanguard Rares, I'm hoping I can get at least one more uh, Dragonic Vanquisher, because that one's the more expensive of the VRs, for sure. So, uh, let's get to it. Hope everybody's staying safe. I know we're kind of in a weird, weird place with uh, all this sickness and health-related issues that is happening worldwide. I'll just take the plastic off this while I'm at it. <clears throat> yeah, hopefully, hopefully I can, because I, I, I was supposed to go to a shop tournament and they canceled because there's the virus set on, uh, in their, in their city, so, uh, no tournaments for me for a while. I'm trying to get into practice with remote fights because it's an interesting concept, especially for someone who doesn't, uh, who can't, who lives very far away from a shop. So, all right, let's get to through these boxes. This, these might be the last two, depending on what I pull out of pull out of them. So uh, let's let's uh, get to it. You know, just enjoy a nice you know, calm opening. Uh, Witch of Iron Chains Ness and Dark Pride Dra Dragon, which is a pretty interesting start. Uh, I have my play set of Dark Pride, so and he's kind of a weird card. Second pack. Oh, sorry about that. Knight of Full Hardiness Lucade. And Spinny's Blade Dra Blader Dragon. Alright. Draco Kid. Hate rares, hate them with a passion. Dragon Dancer Alusa and Sharp Split Dragon. Hate rares with a gigantic passion because they're sticky. Like Saran Wrap. Uh, Knight of Exportation, Barra, and Dragon Dancer, Anastasia, which now I think I have a play set of, which, you know, no complaining here. David, Costi. And a lot of shooter and Volted Horn Dragon. Cool. It's like a Narukami box so far. D 
people say that voltage horn is the the weaker version of eradicator cho which i can kind of see that deaf battle tactical dagger dragoon and yorgos card i see way too often and he's more of a defensive card which yeah could be better Night of Entransmen, Kaelt, and Demonic Dragon Berserker, Chatura, which I think this is the fifth one of him. So I have more than my playset, but I'll put that one up to trade if I ever go back to locals, my local card shop. out of a shop challenge which I've been waiting for for a long time primarily just to show off my moves uh, desert gunner Bajin and yes dragonic vanquisher my fourth one finally uh, got a play set of the expensive one which is nice really really happy about that so I can probably make the deck now uh, still need one more Mighty Bolt Dragoon, but hopefully I can pull that. So, either that or spend 17 bucks <clears throat> or more, depending on how the card economy goes. Ah, hate rares. Desert Gunner Bajin. Press Street. Press Stream Dragon. All right. Now we're going to the third to the last pack. Here. So I guess the tenth one. I'm trying to keep it centered, but I keep trying to make sure I don't, you know, get off center. Inflexible Era Morta and Fort Vessel Dragon. Which is, uh, I guess, the backup to Revan. Alright, second to the last pack, which is the 11th one, I guess. Vanilla card. Knight of Entransman Kilt. And Mighty Bolt Dragoon. I'm kind of done with this box now, essentially. Because I have a playset of every single uh, grade one searcher. And uh, uh, I'm cool with not getting the last Claret Sword. Primarily because that's the cheaper of the, the Vanguards, surprisingly. So uh, pretty much this is pretty much going to be the last opening on him. Last opening box. So I can move on to Astral Force now. Which is awesome. So, yeah, completed my grade one searchers, and uh, yeah, it's it's awesome. Oh, those were two rares that nobody cared about. All right, well, I pretty much completed my collection essentially. If the last box has Claret Sword, then I'm like a hundred percent done with this booster. Which, if I don't get Claire Sword, it's not the end of the world. Uh, gift ones. And now we open our final box of Team Dragon's Vanity. Probably the set I spent the most money on. Primarily because I love all three of these clans. And I love all three of these characters. Alright, let's get this final box opening over with. David Costi.
Blue Ward Command, and Jaggy Shot Dragoon. So, yeah, second pack, I think. Yorgos. And Knight of Full Hardiness, Lucade. Witch of Iron Chains Ness and Dragon Dancer Elusa. So I ordered uh, three Rising Phoenix and one Wyvern Guard Gold because uh, I have already three of them. So I can technically make the uh, Narakami deck. So just need to buy sleeves for it. Sticky cards. Sharp Split Dragon. And Blue Wave Marine General Foibos. This has been a slow start to our box opening so far. But that's good. Because the ending will probably be better. Or Spinius Blade Dragon and Cherish Knight Branwin. That's awesome. That's my fifth one, and uh, that's really good trade fodder right now because I think the Mordred deck is more popular than than uh, Claret Sword. So. Witch of Expertation Barra and Tactical Dagger Dragoon. Costi, Draco Kid, Analyze Shooter. And Battle Siren Narissa. I think this is my fourth one, so I completed this place set of her. Alright. David. Shit. Sticky cards. Anoi Shooter. And Blue Wave Soldier Senior Baragios, which that's my sixth one. So that's more trade fodder. Got a lot of grade one searchers, so I can get a lot of value out of them. And trader and trade for like older stuff for like coral salt or something like that. Maybe for a, a Maelstrom deck. Or Maelstrom VRs, I guess. Night of Entransmit Kilt. And Desert Gunner Bajin. Alright, you still have not seen our Vanguard Rare, which will probably be in this pack now that I said it. Or on the third to the last pack. Side Trumpeteer. Uh, Press Stream Dragon. And Onyx Dust Dragon. For the Blaster Dark deck. Can't wait to see what the what the G series reboot is is all about, honestly. 
can't wait for it, honestly. Can't wait to make Chrono Jet Dragon deck. Yeah, Night of Entrancement Kilt. And last card, Revan. Sweet. Got a fifth one, which is good enough because that means I can trade that SVR one for a good value. I mean, honestly, all you need is the card. The rarity doesn't really matter for winning. It just shows off how much money you spend on the game. And this is the last pack, by the way. And I don't think we're getting anything out of this one. Inflexible Era Morta. And Blitz Caliber Dragon. So, uh, yeah, let's see. Revan. Got Grade 1 Searchers. I finished my Nerissa playset, so that's that's really good. And I guess for the, the complete video, uh, complete video of the recap. Uh, yeah, look at that. That's great. I finished my playsets of these cards. Extra trades. So yeah, this box was these these two boxes were great because. Uh, not only did I finish Draconic Vanquisher, I finished the completion of Mighty Dr Bolt Dragoons. I got extra trade fodders, finished play sets of these. So, uh, for sure, this is the final video for uh, Team's Dragon Vandy because I'm going to move on to the Astral Force next just because it's uh, not that I care about Genesis or anything. But the Angel Feather stuff is interesting. I kind of... I don't really care for the Angel Feather Vanguard. But... Uh, I, I do like my Zerachiel Metatron deck. And I want to improve that with the support cards. And for the Gear Chronicle, for sure I want... I want everything that has to do with the Gear Chronicle... Because I'll probably make multiple decks for, for get the Gear Chronicle ones. So, um, yeah, because I'm going to make the Gr Chrono Tiger deck and then the Chrono Jet Dragon deck. And it's going to be great, honestly. So, uh, yeah. Um, so, yeah, that's for sure going to be the end of it. To, I guess the grand finale recap, um, I have... A total of five Revens, four Dragonic Vanquishers, and three Claret Swords, which I can just buy the singles of. I can buy one more Claret Sword. It's not a problem because it it's the cheaper one of the of the three. And then I managed to finish completing the playsets of all my Grade One Searchers. So everything else, like these two, Bragios and Branwin. Uh, they're definitely trade fodder for more expensive older stuff, I guess. For example, like original Maelstrom, um, uh, Ezels, uh, what else? Anything from the Kagro extra booster stuff, you know, like Light of Destruction and Hero Heroic Elv Evolution or something like that. But yeah. <laughs> that's yeah this is pretty much going to be the last video on team dragon vanity which i really like to set all three of my favorite clans and that's i'm going to be trying to making decks of all of them which i can now because i have play sets of almost everything so uh thank you all for watching uh be sure to stay safe out there i know we're we're in a weird time where quarantine is almost mandatory and I know everybody is scrounging around for supplies and food so just be careful remember you don't need that much toilet paper if you do then you have serious problems so yeah <laughs> that's pretty much it uh, I'll see you in the next opening which will probably be Astral Force so yeah thank you all for watching see you in the next one